Grains, look, I'm gonna set my. You see what I'm doing for you, G's gang? Look, I'm setting my time because when I get up here, sometimes I be cutting up. Yep. I said it. Look, 10 minutes and 30 seconds, Perfect. and it's gonna beat, and I'm gonna know I need to wrap it up. All right, all right. I'm with you. I trust you, man. All right, appreciate you. How y'all doing? I'm good. I'm good, man. This is like the. This feel real. Awkward. Everybody's spaced out, and then the light is blocking y'all out back here. Y'all chilling. That's the VIP section back there, y'all. Y'all didn't get. Y'all weren't invited to VIP. <laughs> They too good for us up here. We up here dancing and sweating. They're like, mm -hmm. next song, baby. You can sing, baby. Take your time. That's what they say in church when you forget the words a little bit. Take your time. They all spaced out over here like somebody farted in one of these sections. And they, everybody just spaced out. Nobody want to take the blame. Hey, y'all give it up for all the positive music I've been hearing tonight. I don't know this is a good song. I don't even know if this right here is on stage. Yeah. Look, yeah, how you doing? You right here? It's like you broke something. We holding. <laughs> you got that, baby. You got that. Little kid was up here. That's how little kids supposed to rap. All right, little kids say drug free and yeah. stuff like that. I need him to make a song to say sugar free. All right, I ain't scared of ten year olds on drugs. If anything, you can slow down. All right, but what I'm worried about is that sugar. And they always got all the same questions. You got any games on your phone? No. <laughs> No, I pay bills on my phone. All these apps is for bills. Capital One, that's not a game. All right, that's something I gotta pay. Pepco, that's what I pay. All right, y'all want downloading all these games on my phone. What's the other question they always ask? It's too, uh, uh, can I sit up front? What's in the front seat that adults never knew about? I got out the car, dropped my niece and nephews off. I just went on sat in the passenger seat before I pulled off. I'm like, I wanna see how this feel. Cause he always, I'm checking under the seat. See if you got toys under there, son. Oh no. Where my wife at? Y'all give it up for my wife right over here. Hey, good, good. That's my baby right there. Oh, I caught that one. I ain't see that. I'm gonna keep that for later right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we did it the right way. I know this positive, so I always make sure I share how we were celibate. We were celibate. Yeah, okay. Sex is a band-aid. Girl got a worst, worst attitude. Oh, bro, nah, it's, you need to be celibate. She got a, she got a nonprofit. She always uh, teach abstinence and stuff like that to high school girls. We were celibate for about a year. We were celibate for about a year and six months. A year, six months, twenty-three days, fourteen hours, about nine minutes. Yeah, I ain't never been so strong a day in my life, boy. I was picking up stuff when he supposed to get picked up, boy. My grandma put my car down, boy. I said park it, I ain't say drag it. Been a mess my axle up. I almost picked up a charge. Officer, I just wanted to see something. I'm just trying to see something. Man, my wife, we don't argue either. We get in disagreements about little stuff, like lotion. See, I'm dark skinned. Where are my dark skinned people at in here? Dark skin, okay, now you brown. Now you're brown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You dark skin, dog. To them light skinned folks, you dark skin. Don't even try to pick a side. Just come on over here. Just come in. Ain't no middle. Ain't no middle. Man, look. As a dark skin brother, when it comes to lotion, I'm gonna put lotion on what you're gonna see. And this is not up for debate. Okay? Underneath of here, I can look like a stretched up used chalkboard. But it ain't none of your business. Don't worry about where my lotion go. They just light-skinned people mad at us with lotion because we wear ash better than them, okay? When light-skinned people get too ashy, look, I heard the hate right over here somewhere. Look, when they get ashy, it look like eczema or something like that. Us, it's, you can tell when we ashy, okay? They hating on us. So me, when I'm going out, if I got a short sleeve on, I'ma put lotion on the joints. I'ma put lotion on my hands. I'ma hit that elbow. You see what I'm saying? If I got shorts on, I'ma hit that knee and I'm hit that ankle. And that's only if I got ankle socks on. You see what I'm saying? Whatever left, I'm going for on or wherever else. So with that mindset, me and my wife finally move in together the next day, we gotta go to work. I look over there and she all over here. Put lotion on the whole body. I need to know who gonna see all of that when you get to work, okay? Hey, my man right here. Hey, look, you married brother? Yes, sir. My wife would tell me, put some lotion on my back for what? It's lotion, it's a back on the t-shirt. And when you get back home, your back better be ashy. That's all I got to say about that. 
I'm sitting here putting lotion on all this stuff. Ain't nobody gonna see that. I don't care about no moisturized skin. I'll peel that skin back for you. That's what I'm here for. If it get that dry, sure. And wonder why she always cold. If you'd be ashy under them clothes sometimes, that's another layer right there. You out here missing out. Shit. All these kids. My man right here, what's up, bro? What's your name, bro? Huh? Case? Case, you gonna sleep good at night. Case been up here all day. Yeah. 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 Hey. Case been up here, boy. My man jumped down a while ago. The hallelujah. Dude, where, where was he at, man? That right there proves God is real, man. Because none of these rappers up here look any different than the other rappers. Okay? But it's on the inside. On the inside. You don't know what you could probably buy from the other dude back in the day. You know what I'm saying? But what happened? No. I was saying who you was talking about. Oh, 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 yeah, you you and the other dude, too, that jumped down here and was rapping with y'all. S. Dot. S. Dot, I ain't see him, man. I gotta, I gotta buy something from him. He backstage, chill. He's tight, but I ain't ready for kids yet. Nope, unless you could pick the gender. If you could pick a gender, it'd be a little different. I'm scared to get a little girl. As soon as they come out, I'm gonna kiss and just go straight to jail. I ain't even, I ain't even doing that. I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna cut y'all investigation short before it even happened. I'm gonna save a life. Ew, bad kids. Ooh, I got a, I got a cousin named Erica, right? And she was just starting at middle school. Called me over, say, Raheem, she really likes you. You the big cousin. Maybe you can get her to come out the room. First day of school, I go there. Erica, what? <laughs> Erica, come on out here. No, I'm not going to school. Why? <laughs> Cause they're so mean. All they do is throw stuff at me, call me names. I'm like, what? At the middle school? I was like, man. I said, but Erica, listen, you can do this, okay? For three reasons. What? Cause you is smart. You is kind. And you the teacher. If you don't get out of that room and take your behind the work. You got bills to pay, and you in here worried about these kids being bad. I can't, I don't want to go. It's so bad. And you can't put your hands on other people's kids. But what's wrong with your feet, Erica? What is wrong with your feet? I'm all in here with it. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to kick him in his tooth. He should have been taller. He should have been taller. Oh, somebody say, wait a minute, don't be kicking my grandbaby. Don't be kicking my grandbaby in school. Come on, the bruises on. That's what my grandma said, we don't beat clothes. We don't beat clothes. Uh -uh. Them clothes didn't do nothing to me. Them clothes didn't break my good china. Mm -hmm. And I got a sore spot thing in my mouth. People laughing, they didn't get good beatings. We got their hands tapped and stuff like that. That ain't no beating. I mean, my grandma would beat me for just the smallest stuff too. My grandma, and this is another reason I want kids. I ain't got time to be beating kids, and correcting them, and stop this, stop that. They just try everything that's brand new. If I told you not to put your finger in this hole, don't put your finger in this one. <laughs> my grandma woke me up in the middle of the night. Where are my old school people at? Where are all the people? I'm talking about old school, old school. I'm talking about people that know about Tussie. The ones I'm talking to. The ones who know what Tussie is. Look at the young people don't know what Tussie is. Tussie, that right there is just deodorant. You used to dip your finger in, have the red top, yeah. and you smear it under there. Right? And, then, and, then, and then get a little comfort. You got here with this. You got to spread it like that right there. And you start sweating, and that white drip start coming down the red. See, that's who I'm talking to. My grandma woke me up from a good dream. Okay? All I know is I felt, that's all I heard. She makes sound effects when she whooping. All I feel, not no belt. I'm talking about closed fists. Right? I wake up. I'm crying. What I do? What I do? This is how petty old school people are. I want you to get up. Get in that kitchen and wash that spoon out of the sink. You whooped me in my sleep over a spoon 
in the sink. Yeah, I got down so I can see who all the people is right here. I can call CFSA on. Uh huh. Y'all raise your hands high in the back now. Just wait till you get that knock on the door. Miss Johnson, I need you to come with this. Oh. I'm calling her, y'all. I already called him on my grandma. Shoot, I'm gonna go. She got visitation a little later now. Shoot, I'm calling her, y'all. Last thing though, like I said before, you can't pick a gender. Cause if I go to jail, it's up to me and the man up top. After the rapture, I got to answer to him why I, what I did, Mike, at the playground. And I got a smart mouth. I already know what I'll get in trouble for, and I still won't be able to stop myself from saying it once I got up there. Cause he gonna say, Raheem, why did you do that to Mike at the playground? First of all, first of all, Mike ain't had no business putting his hands on my door. Raheem, but there's more than one way. Listen, God, don't talk to me about what I should do and how I should raise my daughter. You didn't even have a daughter. First of all, you had a begotten son. Okay? It's a big difference. It just for 316 said, For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son. He did not give you a daughter, so you don't even know. And who you think you are, God? God, he is God. First ticket going to hell right there. Because of a little girl. But what if, but what if God did have a daughter? For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten daughter. Can you imagine how many times the Bible would say Jesus wept? <laughs> I wanna know how soon Motrin would have been invented. Like, <laughs> Jesus as a woman, can you imagine the foot washing ceremony? Come on, Peter, Peter, come on, come on. Oh my God, Peter! <laughs> I'm gonna splash those. I'm not washing those, people. I'm not washing those. Come on, Judas. Oh, never mind, Judas. Don't you come up here. I already know your feet raggedy. All you do is run and tell stuff. You can go here by your bitch. You don't know what I'm talking about now, but you gonna know in a couple years. Judas. Good old Judas. Can you imagine? You already know Jesus is black. So you know you can't tell no black woman who she is and who she ain't. You are no Messiah. You are a peasant. First of all, boo boo. <laughs> no, get off me, John. I'm gonna let him know this time. First of all, first of all, back up, Simon Peter. Look, you wanna cut some ears off? You need to start right now, cause listen. First of all, I'm the first and the last. The beginning and the end. <laughs> Alpha and Omega. Off the end and finish of your little dirty, dusty, trifling little life. <laughs> you know nothing about me. I don't know nothing about you. Boy. Boy, boy, you see that little cut over your eye? You got that because you was running by the whale and they told you to stop. You tripped, you hit your head on the whale. Remember that? Uh-huh, right there, you was about six. That little ugly limp you got, that happened when you was about 13. Your mama told you not to ride the donkey when she wasn't around. And you fell off, broke your little stupid leg, and now you got your lump, and now you got your limp. Matter of fact, it's ironic, cause as soon as you fell off the ass, you became one. Bye. Oh, 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 oh. They don't even come out to 2018. You won't even know about it. <laughs> so I look, y'all. My buzzer done rung off two, three times in here. Look, I wish I had more time. I had like 20 minutes of material to give y'all, but it's all good. Y'all can follow me on Instagram at ambitious.1 for my uh, under 15 kids who don't know how to spell that just yet. That's A M B I T I O U S. Look, you mad because you ain't know how to spell it. <laughs> A-M-B-I-T-I-O-U-S. 